What is up, my fellow Rogamons? Welcome to a very special episode today. As by the title, you can see it is mail day, and yeah, I actually got some really cool things in the mail, and I have some mystery stuff I don't even know yet sent by a few friends. So I've opened mail in the past on this channel, but mainly I just did it like randomly. I didn't really uh, advertise it on the video, but today, you know, we got three different packages in the mail, so I decided to do a video just for that, and we'll have packs at the end to open as well. But the first thing I got is from the Pokemon Center itself. Yes, and what could it be? Uh, I, I already pre-opened all these two, so I wouldn't have to like waste your time opening them on camera, but we got the one in 5,000 Master Ball. Let's go. I can't believe I actually got one of these. Tyler, you know. You know Tyler uh, on the channel. He always hooked us up, and he actually like just hit me up. He's like, bro, you got to go on and get one of these right now. So I did. You can see it on the camera right in front. One in 5,000. Now, I'm actually going to make a whole video about this, so I'm not really going to go in-depth at opening this right now. So just wait for the video. It'll be like just a special like little five-minute video. And, you know, it won't, be on a, it won't be my regular Tuesday video. Those are usually opening videos, so it'll just be randomly dropped. But, yeah, one in 5,000. It looks like that. It lights up everything. I actually haven't even opened it yet because I wanted just to get it all on the video and everything and keep it very nice. But yeah, you can see it's the limited edition premium quality, highly accurate Master Ball replica. It's a perfect opportunity to celebrate 25 years of Pokemon. And I'm going to say, you can read the rest there too. But we'll go over it in depth in the video. But the Master Ball is my favorite Pokeball. And yeah, that was an amazing item to receive. Now, second off, you guys know Chow. Uh, he goes by Chicago Chow, everything. You know, you'll see his uh, little links right below me. I'll pop them up for you. They'll be in the description as well. He sent me a big package too, and uh, he sent me mail before as well, like awesome stuff to open and whatnot, and we actually opened one of his uh, GX Tag Team All-Stars booster box as well, but this is just for me apparently, and the first thing we see in there is the double card, let's go, oh, this is Hop's Pokemon, so this is as close as he could get <laughs> to me hating Hop, bro, this is hilarious, oh, <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to do with these. I honestly say I'm going to do something with them, though. I know Arvazu, he makes the music. He wants me to make like a cool backdrop with them. So maybe we'll actually have time to do that. But holy crap. Woohoo! Oh, chap. You did not have to do this, bro. Look what this man's did. Holy crap. <laughs> oh, this is Sword and Shield Ultra Premium Collection. Holy crap, boys. Let's go! Now this, I'm gonna make a special video. Just look at this, look at this unit, the sword and shield. I can't even show it to you on camera, I'll try, but yeah, we'll show you what's like in it. You can see my reflection. Yeah, there's all these packs, all these gold cards. Oh, wow, dude. Yeah, this is gonna be its own video in itself, so be on the lookout for that. We'll definitely be opening this one day, but chow, you did not have to do that, dude. That is, whoo. Wow, I cannot believe the support from my friends. And he said, yeah, this is for me. This isn't even his. This is mine. Get to keep whatever's in it, get to open it. I saw him open one of these, and he actually pulled a VMAX Charizard. I'm hoping the Chucky Chew is in there, either the rainbow or just the regular VMAX. But thank you so much, Chow. That was awesome. And yeah, we'll get into the final mail, and then we'll open some packs for you guys. This one is from Wiki, a.k.a. Alex. I won't show you the package on screen, but yeah, he sent it here. I'll do it. <laughs> Last time I actually flashed the child's address, so I had to block it out, but yeah, I I, pre I haven't even looked at what's in this yet. I just pre-opened it, so it would uh, be good. We're gonna look, oh, oh, we got a little deck box here. You can see, let's go to the two split camera. This is obviously from McDonald's, and I know what these are. Well, I don't know what all these are, but they're cards, obviously. Oh. He just sent me some random cards from the uh, Rapid and Single Strike or whatever they call it in the Japanese. I don't know, but we're going to be opening some of these too in English though. But the Japanese are, cards are super sick. Yo, that is a sick slow bro. Look at the artwork on these guys. Hey, Carbonite. Such a sick Pokemon. I was not expecting to get these. I was only expecting, uh, he was sending me some McDonald's Hollows that I actually needed for my collection. Ooh, Mustard. He actually opened up, uh, he got the full art mustard. 
not the rainbow, the regular one, but the full arm mustard is definitely a card I would want. Obviously, you know, the Tyranitar. Ooh, and he has both the rapid strike and the single strike. I'm more of a fan of the single strike just because it reminds me of One Punch Man, man. You only need that one strike. That's it. One and done. Oh, we got the Weeping Bell, too. <laughs> that is funny. These are funny cards, man. I like them. You got the Mankey. Looking cool. Yeah, the, the artwork on these are super sick. The Tepig. So this actually goes with the full art Tyranitar. It tells like a story, and those, those cards are super sick. Uh, I love when the cards tell a story. It was kind of like the Vivid Voltage promos that also tell a story. That, I don't know. I don't read Japanese. It does something, though. It's like a scroll or a chain or something. And for the final one, ooh, that is a sick card. Now they actually have the shiny. He pulled the shiny Houndoom, too, the gold one. That, honestly, I wouldn't mind getting that card in my hands, too. So hopefully, I think I might open a booster box of that. I'm not sure. Depending on how many booster boxes I can get, too, if anyone's watching, um, I will gladly break a booster box for you for retail. Or what I get it at, I guess, is what I'm saying. I'll charge you what I get it at, plus you'll have to pay shipping. But I won't charge you any more than that. And I'll break it for you on this channel if you want me to. So let me know. There's more goodies in here. Oh! Oh, okay. Wow. So sick, dude. I actually did want this card. That is awesome, dude. Wow, Wiki. Thank you. <laughs> he didn't know I actually wanted this. Uh, get him in there. He's falling out. But yeah, I actually did want this card. This is from the... Uh, uh, what is it? It's like a red long box. It's like the Pokemon kit or something. Pokemon card kit or something. I don't know. But there's two to Denny's that come in it. And that's the only way you can get this promo card. But that is super sick, man. Thank you so much. It actually looks like super perfect. The centering is a little off. I'm not going to be grading it, of course. It's just going to my collection. But next, we have the Cramorant VMAX. Let's go. I don't even have this one yet either. This is from uh, Shining Fates. Wow. And then, woo! Yes, I love this card so much. Uh, if anyone actually has the one that has Pikachu in it as well, hit me up. I'm looking to purchase that one as well. I have this one too, but you know, I always need more than one, honestly. <laughs> I collect Mimikyu's, Mew's, Pikachu's, all that. So I take as many as possible that I can have. Any amazing rare as well. Oh, we got the Mudkip. Let's go. That is super sick. It's not a hollow bleed one, but it's like, man, it looks super dark. But I needed this one for my McDonald's set too. And hopefully you guys found some McDonald's. And then oh, the final one, actually, it's funny. I have every single Volcarona except this one from Cosmic Eclipse. I have the rainbow and the full art. So, oh, thank you, Wiki. And I'll definitely be trading you some cards too for these as well. So, we got to get rid of my bulk, you know. Let's see, what else? Oh, you just did some extra pack. Oh, oh no, what is this? What is this? Oh, what is this? What is this? Yo! 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 Golden Mew, dude! What? Holy crap! He has a, he has a 3D printer, I know that, and uh, he didn't even tell me he was sending this, but he 3D printed a Mew, dude? Oh, Mew is one of my favorite Pokemons of all time. That is sick. And look how detailed that is. Golden Mew, man. Wow, dude. Oh, woo He's going to be sitting up here for right now. He's going to be the good luck charm. We'll have to incorporate him into the setup. I want to change my setup a little bit, too. Um, but, you know, it might take a little time. Uh, I'm going to try to move it into a new space eventually. So, wow, dude. And there's still more. This box keeps going, apparently. Apparently there's something else really big here. Oh, I don't even know what this is. He was only supposed to be sending me McDonald's cards and then he just went off. <laughs> okay. He used all this confetti. <laughs> That's a gag though. The gold, I like it, I like it. It's just really messy, but. Oh, there's something in here though. What is this? Oh no. Oh dude, I already know what it is. Uh, oh no, 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 oh no. Wiki, I'm sorry, it's peeling. Oh no. Some of the glue or oh, some of the paint peeled off, dude. I'm sorry. Oh no. But it is it is super sick. My bad, dude. Some of the paint just peeled off in here. It was probably the weather. But dude, look at that. Rogamon Army, dude. <laughs> Holy crap. I don't even wanna. I don't know what to do with this. I'm sorry. It is like the paint is peeling off. Um, 
if I can get some like paper towels or something. My girlfriend's back there. Sorry, Wiki. I don't want to like. I don't know what to do with this. <laughs> this is amazing, though. Don't get me wrong. It's just. It's peeling. It's peeling. But dude, what? What? Look at that, dude. That is amazing. I don't know why it's peeling like that, though. I don't know where to put it. I'm just, sorry. I can't put it up there just because it's uh. You know, I gotta let it chill for a minute, and I'll have to ask him what uh, what I should do with this. But wow, dude, thank you for that. <laughs> and I might have to take a little break because I gotta wash my hands off before I open some Pokemon cards here. Dude, this is super sick, dude. Thank you so much. I mean, honestly, it kind of looks cool with the paint chipping off anyway. But yeah, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. I'm sure he'll let me know what to do. But wow, we're gonna cut the video here for one second and we'll be back. I gotta wash off my hands, but that was an amazing mail opening and we'll get right into busting packs after this. Yo, welcome back. You know, I had to clean up my hands before I opened that, but wow, dude, that is super sick. We're gonna, before we go into the next part of the video, let's just take a minute, get like a 30 second montage of what we can send of the Mew and stuff. And yeah, let's watch that real quick before we get back. Wow, it looks even better in person. It is a little shame that the paint came off a bit, but you know, that part can easily be fixed. There's no worries about that. I'm gonna just ask him what kind of paint he used and you know, we'll get it painted back up and looking super sick, dude. But the gold and black with the logo and everything, woo -hoo! it's definitely gonna be coming up here shortly. But right now we have Mew. He'll be our good luck charm for right now. And yeah, I got a special little treat. Uh, you haven't seen these on the shelves in a while. Little Cosmic Eclipse and Unified Mind Packs. And I got these from Party City. Good luck, uh, the cat got out of the bag. A lot of people ended up going to Party City and finding these, so. But you know, you may get lucky and find some, a few. Uh, a few of these at Party City. I picked up all the blisters. They also had the, uh, or these are sleeves, I guess, is what they call them. They also had blisters, too, with the promo cards as well, like the Pikachus and stuff, so I definitely picked up all those as well. But yeah, let's not waste any time, dude. Oh, this has been an amazing mail day already. Holy crap, dude. That Volcarona is honestly the sickest thing. I'm gonna have like a whole Volcarona shrine coming up here. I got the light up one. My girlfriend got me that. Oh, it's gonna be a great day. And now we're just gonna cut these open because there's like, as you can see, there's a little cellophane. You know, I don't wanna like waste too much time trying to open these for you. Or myself. Uh, I don't wanna make it like a 50 minute video of me trying to open up Unified Minds packs, but we got the dark right on the front and yeah unified minds honestly has become one of my favorite sets i'm gonna do a new thing in this video where i'm not actually gonna give you the code card uh whoever wants the code cards just comment and you know after about three or four days whoever comments i'll just divvy up the code cards between you or i'll split it you know if i keep seeing the same people psychic if i keep seeing the same people wanting the code cards you know i'll split it from each video or i have extras too i can give you so it's not really that big a deal but wow dude I still can't believe we got that. Let's uh, make a little room for myself here. <laughs> this was honestly, dude, mail day is honestly the best. And he sent that a little bit back. So it's, uh, he sent it when it was uh, hot out and it's gotten cold and stuff. You know, it probably just sat in there and the paint just came away. And we got a regular scrappy, so no worries on that. It'll be fixed, no problem. I've actually had it for a couple weeks and uh, he was like, no, you gotta open it. First reaction on stream, I was like, Okay, I feel that. I feel that. I, I will wait, and I'm glad I did because that was super amazing. I still can't get over it, but yeah, let's get in the Cosmic Eclipse. One of my other favorite sets as well. I've actually opened quite a few on this channel too, and I actually have way more Unified Minds as well. I don't have any more Cosmic Eclipse, and it sucks because I don't think they're going to re be reprinting any more of these recently. Uh, fire. Dog. Because they said they were going to reprint them, but then they uh, decided that they weren't going to now. I think they're going to focus mainly on Shining Fates. Hidden Fates is getting another confirmed reprint, or they're, already, they're actually already reprinting. If Be checking your targets. Uh, the tens are going to be coming out, and you can tell they're the reprints because they're actually wrapped. They're not wrapped all the way around the ten, 
with the cellophane. Ooh, that's a nice little one. And did we get something good? Nope. Just a regular Weavile, but uh, yeah, the packaging is actually wrapped around the tin, like the Shining Fates. So it's just like, you know, it's kind of like this. It's like the little plastic wrap, but not wrapped all the way around. And, uh, you can tell that's the reprint as well. I don't think it like really affects value at all or anything. Like you can still, they still work the same. So they might be going down a little bit just because they're reprinting, but that's good. I'm glad they're coming to Target too. Uh, I happened to pick up four because my girlfriend went with me as well. So, you know, I was able to get four of them because they limit two at my Target. I'm just taking the code card off the screen. I'm gonna go big water. So yeah, they've been starting the limit, which is nice. It gives everyone a chance to get some, you know, so. And two isn't bad. You know, some are even doing one. I don't know if you, where you're from, let me know what they're kind of doing. Are they limiting still? Uh, Cause my Walmart hasn't limited yet, but I know a couple towns over, the Walmart's actually only allowing one per person. And come on guys, where is the lug, man? Where is the lug? You know, we usually do the glizzy rub down. We're gonna do that too, but we're gonna actually gonna bring Mew to the party as well. We got, how many more? We got three Unified Minds and one more Cosmic Eclipse to open. So yeah, we're gonna bring that time in the show. You know, we're gonna do the. It's the glizzy rub down. Woo, it's the glizzy rub down. And it's gonna be the Mew rub down. We're gonna rub all the packs on this glizzy right now. And we're gonna, Hit up our boy Mew. He's gonna be part of that Volcarona Shrine as well. That is so sick though. Yeah, we're gonna get him on here and hopefully he can bring some luck and we can actually have some cards up here to display, you know? I, did, I should have actually displayed some of these cards that are super sick up here. So, you know, let's do that right now. I don't know if you can actually see all those, what's getting cut off, but we'll put those up there. Replace the Cramorant. The Cramorant's cool, but those ones are definitely better <laughs> in my opinion. Yeah, let's, uh. Let's see if the Glizzy can bring us a pull, man. Let's, I would love to pull that Mew and Mew 2. Rainbow Rare. I mean, who wouldn't though? It's the chase card in the set, but me specifically, I just love Mew and Mew 2. You guys know by now, you know, I don't have to preach to the choir at all. This pack is feeling extra fat. So, uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I keep forgetting. I'm not gonna give the code cards away. We're gonna do it a different way. Make sure it actually gets in the hands of people who use it. Psychic. It is Leaf. And yeah, we'll make sure that you guys who actually want to use it for the game and not just resell it, because it got to my attention. Um, uh, well, I forget what the guy's name was. I'm sorry, but I know you're watching. Uh, he commented and he told me that uh, basically a bunch of bots get it and then they just resell those packs to other people online. There's like a bunch of groups. And we got the, oh, I've never seen this card before. Hollow, oh, that's actually a really cool hollow. Hollow Garchomp, but yeah, they actually just resell them online to other people. So they're just, they were taking my codes within a matter of seconds. You know, I must have someone who knows my channel or they just attach the bot to follow my channel and then the bot just takes all the code cards. I don't really know how it all works specifically, but something like that. And they've been taking all the code cards, everything like that within a matter of like minutes. So yeah, I can scan the video that fast and get them apparently. I have to look more into actually how they do it, but you know, we're just gonna do it this way. That way, I actually know it's getting into someone's hands that actually wants to enjoy opening them online, opening the code cards. So yeah, we'll just open it off. Stream. No, one, two, three, and we're gonna go big psychic because I'm feeling this pack. Water. This pack feels like it has something amazing in it. Who knows though. I would actually really like to open a bunch of team up too, but uh, those are getting super expensive and I don't think they're gonna reprint those either. I did happen to get a bunch of dollar store blisters and pulled out some super cool cards, full art trainer Erica and uh, I think a rainbow shiftry from those, but you know, that was fun for a dollar store pack. Fletchling and <laughs> Heat Train GX. I think I've actually pulled this one before. It's nothing, it's not really a super crazy card. We're just gonna put them in a sleeve. Um, but yeah, Rogamons, I don't know if anyone on here is looking the trade cards or if anyone's like, if you ever see me pull a card you like or if you want to see what I have. But I am going to be sorting, I actually have pretty much sorted all my bulk. I'm going to be doing a video on how to send your bulk in as well, where I'm going to send mine in, different ways to do it, how to package it, all that. So stay tuned for that. But I'm also have a lot of hollows and a lot of singles that I just want to get rid of. 
And, uh, you know, I'd rather just trade him. Ooh, we saved the best Cosmic Eclipse for last. I've always pulled heat out of the Blastoise ones. But, yeah, just I have super good cards. I'd either trade or, you know, you can buy or whatever. Or, you know, if you really want it, if you really like the card and it's really not worth anything, you know. Who knows? Maybe you'll be lucky. If you're a supporter of the Rogue My Army, I will help give away something to you. You never know. But let's go. Big, uh, what have we guessed? Fairy. Oh, I was going to say water because of Blastoise and that, but it is okay. So, uh, yeah, actually, the rare occurrence we pulled. Super fired, not out of booster packs, but out of the mail. But what would I expect? I wouldn't expect anything less from my friends to just send me absolute crazy mail, dude. Woo, that's so Galio is looking nice. And for the final one, oh, that is a hollow. Wow. A hollow Stoutland. Okay. <laughs> For some reason, I'm becoming the king of opening just regular hollows, and uh, I won't lie, if you've watched my Shining video Fates videos recently, please go back and watch them. I pulled some really good cards. But the funny thing is, I actually opened up way better cards off uh, off camera. But you know how that goes. <laughs> if anyone opens cards on camera here, you know you always open up the best. That's why I try not to open up too many off camera, but sometimes you just have to have fun, you know? You can't always stress yourself on camera to pull crazy stuff you just have to have fun get a video out there and uh, you know I just enjoy people watching me open and I hope you enjoy that as well who we got the stun fist but yes like I said before just comment down below if you would like to participate in the code cards uh, fire I'm gonna try to get some to everyone as well so I actually have ones that are uh, newer too I have more shining fates now codes as well so if someone would like those uh, and if uh, the same person responds and he's the only one, then uh, he'll get them. So that's how we'll just do it. Uh, but if I see you're new and you haven't, then you will get them. Oh, the reverse Pikachu. Wow. I actually don't think I have this one. That is awesome. I collect Pikachus. And for the final one, absolutely nothing. <laughs> so yeah, these blisters were a little lackluster. I actually have more to open up sometime in the future not today not today you know this was more dedicated to mail but I just wanted to get a little opening in for you guys because I wasn't sure what they I didn't expect them to send any packs at all you know I was mainly just expecting the singles I didn't know what Chow was sending but obviously he sent something that's gonna require a whole video in itself to accurately uh, open and portray and do it justice so but yeah but the Pikachu that's probably my poll of the day from the uh, boxes we got all those sick cards from Alex, dude. We got the meal. Let's take one last look at it, you know. If you want to go look at it again, just scroll back in the video and watch the little montage I made of it. It's super awesome, and yeah, that is so sick. We'll get the other painted up, and yeah, next time we're on uh, Rogamon, you know, we're going to have a little new setup and put all our new goodies up there and uh, have it rolling, but... Thanks for watching Rogamon Army. As always, appreciate the support. And if you're a new uh, subscriber, new sub, and have gotten this far in the video, you know, I really appreciate you too. That's awesome. But yeah, uh, we'll see you next week. You know, I'll probably post a Master Ball video as well next week. I'm not sure what I'm going to do. I really want to open a Hidden Fates Elite Trainer Box. So comment down below. Should I open the Hidden Fates Elite Trainer Box or should I open the big sword and shield premium collection that Chow got me. Which one should I do next week? And whichever one I don't do next week, I'll do the next week after, but just write down below what you want me to do. It's been awesome, Rogamons. Have a good one. Yo! Honestly, the videos don't get much better than that, you know? Thanks to all my friends and supporters. There's supporters as well of the channel. That was just awesome. I cannot believe I got that, you know? We're gonna get that vocal run of fix up looking super crispy again. If you want to see my other videos, they'll be right over there. It's been Great Rogamons, and I'll see you next video.